this is Kathleen Cameron from the National Council on Aging, and we're working with, with Judith Light and Santa Fe Pasteur on the Flu Plus U campaign to educate older adults about the seriousness of the flu and the flu vaccine options that they have available to them. I think for older adults, they um, might forget that they need the flu vaccine each and every year because the viruses change and the vaccine changes, and we need to get, get that vaccine each year. And according to the CDC, that's the single best way to protect ourselves from the flu. And the myth that you get sick from the vaccine is actually a myth. It, it is a myth. The, the flu vaccine does not contain live virus. It's actually dead virus that helps to generate our immune system to produce antibodies against the virus so that you cannot get the flu, the flu from the vaccine itself. Right. And the excuses that we hear a lot are things like, I'm too busy, I don't have time, uh, it's at the bottom of the list, uh, yeah. where am I going to go to get it? And all of that can be addressed if you go to the uh, website, which is ncoa.org slash flu. There is uh, an actual statistic that is pretty kind, is quite shocking, and it is that 90% of flu-related deaths happen to people who are 65 and older. That's why I wanted to be a part of this campaign, because I'm over 65, and because the National Council on Aging is talking to us about learning how to age well, and that's something that's really important to those of us who are in the baby boomer generation and beyond. And so um, Santa Fe Pastor has also talked to us about this vaccine and having a higher dose vaccine, and that's something that a lot of people don't know about, it's something that people can actually learn about from their healthcare professional, from their doctor, from their pharmacist, and you can often get these vaccines for free. And so that's why we wanted to really make sure that people knew about this. Nobody has to die from the flu. Nobody should die from the flu. And if you're educated about it, get your flu shot, you'll be okay. I'm not slowing down. My life is more expansive, more, uh, I'm busier now <laughs> than I've ever been. Uh, I, I don't know exactly what I attribute that to, but I also know that I really have to take care of myself. I really have to be vigilant about making sure that I'm healthy and that I'm I'm caring for myself and that I'm not giving anything to anybody around me. I mean, I'm in a business where we're around people all the time, and most people are in life too. I mean, their lives are busy. Some yeah. people have two and three jobs that, you know, they have their kids, they have their, their you know, their folks that maybe they're taking care of. Uh, a lot of us have these kinds of lives now, and that's why it's so important that we really pay attention to our health. If you do not have your health, you do not have anything. And that has not been clearer to me, that, that, has, been, that has been made clearer to me mm -hmm. as mm -hmm. I have matured um, and, and as I look at myself and I, and I look at the people around me. It's really, it's really the truth. And I know for young people they say, oh yeah, she's just an old lady talking about that stuff. But the truth is, you really need to take care of yourself and your health, really important. Absolutely, and I think studies have shown what's most important to older adults is their health, because that allows them to remain independent sure. and to be able to do the things that they want to do on a, on a daily basis, whether it's travel or spending time with their grandchildren. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. So, or with their children. Some people yes. have children in their 60s. That's so, right, right. You know, life, life is changing. Life is different, yeah. and we have to keep up with it. Absolutely, and the single best way to prevent the flu yeah. is to get the flu vaccine.